Before we start, here's a quick message. If you haven't heard about Anchor, it's the easiest way to make a podcast. Let me explain. Number one, it's free. What? Yes, it is. Number two, there's creation tools that allow you to record and edit your podcast right from your phone or computer. Mm -hmm. Number three, Anchor will distribute your podcast for you. It can be heard on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, and many more. And lastly, you can make money from your podcast. What? Yes, you can. It's everything you need to make a podcast in one place. So download the free Anchor app or go to anchor.fm to get started. Now let's get back to the show. Welcome to the Soul Train Express, where we inspire, encourage, and rebuild. So jump on board. I'm Chelsea J, and today is True Talk Tuesday, and we're going to talk about some truth. So please subscribe to our podcast and channel today so we can journey through life together. So how do we determine what is true or false? Does everyone have their own truth or can we prove that there's only one truth? Can we prove how we live or how we view the world correlates with truth? Hmm, let's talk about it. Because I know it's important to recognize what we believe, why we believe it, and how we can prove that it is true. So there's three questions that we should ask when we are evaluating whether something is true or false. The first question, is it internally consistent? There has to be consistency with what we are going to believe that is true. Truth leads to consistency, not discrepancy. The next question, does it correspond to reality? Are we able to connect it to what is going on with reality? What we see today, our worldview how we view the world. Are we able to connect it? Does it correspond? Does it relate? Pigs are not flying. That does not correspond to reality. Therefore, that is false. The next one, is it livable? So it not only has to be consistent, it not only has to correspond to reality, but it has to be livable. Can you live it out? Because our truth connects with our identity. Let me give you a quick example. True or false? Women have the ability to become pregnant. Of course, we can go deeper in genetically, scientifically, and statistically proving that women were created with a womb to birth. But let's just keep it simple. Can we consistently prove that women have the ability to become pregnant? True or false? True. Yes. We can consistently see throughout generations, throughout life, that women have the ability to become pregnant. Based on how women were created, we as women have internal organs that realistically prove that we can give birth and men cannot. That's the reality. And is this truth livable? Yes. Women are still having babies. Women have the ability to be pregnant. So that's something basic and simple that we can just look at, but it allows us to know what is true or false. So now I encourage you. I encourage you to identify what you believe or do not believe and see if it passes the test of truth. Here's a train of thought. We have a right to believe whatever we want, but not everything we believe is right. Ravi Zacharias.